Just a second, I just gotta, you know, finish three passing all you guys. Man, that yo-yo guy, freaking yo-yo mancer out there. Last time I even tried picking up a yo-yo, I clocked myself in the head, just woke up in the hospital two days later with a concussion and an uncontrollable desire to wear a squirrel costume. It's Furcon, I can make that joke here. It's real nice to be able to do jokes at a Furcon because you guys were all furries. I can make certain references that just would go over the heads of most of the places I perform at. Usually I go to like redneck comedy clubs or something. I try to make a joke like, so I was trying to connect to the internet the other day. What's the internet? <laughs> but no, here, here I can make a joke about dragon ear and it makes sense. Otherwise it's just, no, no, he, he runs this furry website. It, it's an important one. No, 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 we all hate him, but... No, no, we really want him to stay around. Nobody's crazy enough to take that job. I can make that joke here, and not only do you people laugh, but by the time I'm done with this set, I'm probably gonna be banned from F.A. So I'm sure some of you have noticed I am, in fact, wearing a suit. Not, not a fursuit, I'm wearing what the other 90% of the world thinks of when you say, I'm putting on a suit. There's actually a bit of a story behind it that, even if you don't want to listen to, I'm gonna tell you anyways. I've been, a, my fursuit has been a snow leopard for about 10 years now, ever since I joined in the fandom, thank you. And I mean, it makes perfect sense for me. I'm a ginger, so, you know, white and spotty, it's, it's perfect. <laughs> but you know, snow leopards, there's a lot of us these days. I've tried, you know, mixing it up a bit. Now I'm a gay blue-haired snow leopard. That narrows me down to about 80% of the snow leopards in this fandom. No, I, I decided that it, it's time for a change. Time to mix it up a bit. Ten years, everybody else has their own custom OC character. I think it's time for me to change. So tonight, in front of all you guys, in front of all of Furcon, and all you people watching on live stream, I'll be debuting my new persona, my original species, an anthropomorphic Neil Patrick Harris. suited up. And if you guys see The Hunger Games, The Hunger Games is probably my favorite new franchise to be coming out in the last decade. It, it really represents a vision of the future that it, it just speaks to me, you know? And not the whole, you know, systemic slaughter of innocent children for the amusement of millions, but actually... Not, not that whole part, but no, it represents my dream vision of a world. All the people in the capital, you see, they all dress like they are right out of a Lady Gaga music video. I yearn for the days where I will be able to walk down the streets in broad daylight dressed like a metrosexual Klingon. And people will look at me and say, God, what a boring outfit. I've gotten on Tumblr recently. I've been, been spending a lot of time there. I've really, really started to come in with the whole social justice movement on there. I really like those people on there because they're the only people who don't hate me for being ginger. I mean, granted, granted, they do hate me for being a white, cisgendered male, or what's the word that they use? It's a, oh, literally Hitler. But you know what? I still get to say things like, check your hair privilege. <laughs> Anyways, I think that's about my time for tonight. You guys have been awesome. If you like my stuff, uh, you can definitely follow me on Twitter. I'm at SeraphLS. If you didn't, however, be sure to follow me on Twitter. I'm at Dragoneer. <laughs> Thank you, guys.